we can't get enough of the air fryer. So we cooked up the Jet Setter Air Fryer Pork Chops. Now these chops are moist with a fruity, smoky taste that is so easy to prepare. We suggest getting thick bone-in pork chops, about one and a half to two inches thick. Now this recipe works for two good-sized chops. Pat the chops dry with paper towels. Let them sit for a few minutes at room temperature. Then use two teaspoons of olive oil and lather up the pork chops. Here's the wet rub we suggest. In a bowl, mix two tablespoons of brown sugar. Next, and this is a must, two tablespoons of smoked paprika. Add in a teaspoon of salt along with a teaspoon of black ground pepper. Now scoop in two tablespoons of Dijon mustard. Add a teaspoon of onion powder. Then finish the mix with two more tablespoons of olive oil. Now mix it all up. Then drop in the oiled up pork chops and pile on the mix. Make sure to use it all over the pork chops. Reheat the air fryer to 400 for five minutes. Then move the fully lathered and seasoned pork chops into the air fryer. Cook at 400 for 12 minutes. Flip them at six minutes. Be sure to use a meat thermometer to make sure that the pork is at least 145 degrees. Remove and let them sit for a few minutes, then serve. Now in this night, we paired a side dish of baked beans and some oven roasted spiced potato fries. For wine, we went with white, the Chateau St. Michel Chardonnay from Washington. You could go with red too, with a Pinot Noir. You will love the succulent pork that is moist and not dripping in oil. We'll have more air fryer recipes for you that are delicious, quick, and healthy. Enjoy, Jet Setters.